Hey guys, Bubba Bricks here with another video, and this time I'm here to give you guys a top 10 video for the top 10 things you probably didn't know about LEGO. So without further ado, let's get right into this. Now starting off with number 10, number 10 is if all the LEGO pieces on the planet were divided equally among every single person on the planet, there would be enough for everyone to have on average 86 LEGO bricks. So just think about that for a second. That would mean that out of the 2 billion people on the planet, uh, every single person would get half 86 bricks. So that is pretty crazy. Number 9, LEGO is the biggest tire manufacturer. So just think about this for a second. This means that LEGO is bigger than all the other tire manufacturers for cars, tractors, anything, uh, even like other toy things, pr maybe even such as Hot Wheels and stuff. They may make even more tires than that, so that's pretty crazy right there as well. Number 8. During the holiday season, 28 LEGO sets are sold every single second. So just think about that for a second. That means that every single second, uh, around probably November, December, 86 LEGO, I mean, 28 LEGO sets are sold. So if you do the math, that would mean that over um, every minute there would be a couple hundred sets that are being sold, and every day, that would just be an insane amount. Do the math if you want. Number seven, the name LEGO originated from the Danish word LEGOTI, which means play well. Now, I actually saw a video about this, in the video like it was like a band drove by the guy who created LEGO when he was sitting in his office and he saw it said LEGOTI, which means play well in the Danish language, and he decided to shorten it and name it LEGO. I'm not quite sure if that's quite what happened, but still, LEGO is a shortened abbreviation for play well, so that's pretty cool. Number 6, LEGO bricks used to be called automatic binding bricks. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty glad that that's still not the name because that just sounds really technical and scientific and not as fun as saying, hey, look at all my Legos over here, and, and rather than saying, hey, look at all my automatic binding bricks. I don't know about you guys, but I'm glad that they decided to stick with Lego. Number 5, the first LEGO bricks made in 1958 are still compatible with the ones made today. So that means that ever since LEGO started making bricks, how they've been making them hasn't changed at all. They've made new pieces, but, those, but the pieces that they made back when they started in 1958 are still compatible with the ones made today. I mean that you can still attach them and play with them as you would be able to with the ones made today. So that's pretty cool right there. And that shows that they have a lot of dedication and that they're not going to change just to go and make the toy um, more modern or different. Number four, um, there are 19 billion LEGO parts manufactured each year. That means that 2.6 million parts are made each hour and 36,000 per minute. That means that more than 400 billion LEGO pieces have made sense, have been made since LEGO started making LEGO bricks. So that is really crazy. This is probably one of the most interesting facts out of all these facts to me, at least. Make sure to tell me what you guys think about this and if you guys are just blown away by how many that is. Number three, on average, children around the world spend five billion hours a year playing with Lego bricks. So what this means is that if you put all the time that all of the kids around the world are playing with Legos and add it all up, that would be about five billion hours a year. So that is pretty crazy right there. I would guess it's slowly dropping with how big of a deal video games are becoming and how toys are kind of not becoming as popular. But still, uh, five billion hours a year is pretty insane. Number two, if all the if all the four billion Lego bricks in the world were stacked on top of each other, they would be able to connect the Earth to the Moon ten times. Now that is crazy. That would mean that those uh, thousands of miles from the Earth to the Moon would be able, probably even more than that, would be able to be connected uh, ten times with the Lego bricks that have been created. That right there is really crazy. And now, finally, number one, the big one. If LEGO minifigures were real people, they would be the world's largest population. So that right there is really crazy to think that if all the LEGO minifigures around the world were all put together and were real, they would be the world's largest population. 
So then there you have it. There is my top 10 things you probably didn't know about LEGO. Make sure to tell me what you guys think about this video and if you would like to see any more top 10s in the comment section below. This is Boba Bricks and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.